Hey everyone, how y'all doing? Hope you're having a great day so far. Uh, I wanted to do a video talking about this movie that I watched a couple weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago. Uh, it's called CODA, uh, which stands for Child of Death Adults. And it covers the story of uh, a family which has three deaf uh, people and one young girl who is who can listen uh, like most of uh, of the population can and uh it was very interesting i i enjoy these kind of movies to have a better insight into what the lives of people who are deaf are like um and the whole thing with sign language and communicating and how they integrate with society. It's interesting to know more about it and see it. And I think they did a great job on this movie to portray uh, that um, and get us engaged and understanding, uh, have us understand or relate to the difficulties of, of uh, this family and the person who also, in this case, the, the girl, Ruby, uh, what she faced uh, being a part of the family and being stuck between wanting to be normal like everyone else and wanting to be, you know, a supporting member of the family and how difficult it can become uh, to have those two things at the same time. Uh, on this particular story, Ruby ended up discovering that she wanted to sing, uh, be a singer. Um, and for the rest of the family, it was a bit hard to understand, not just because they didn't want her to pursue her dreams like any parent wants for their children, but because they were in difficulties um, dealing or beca being a part of, of uh, the society they were in, the little town that they were a part of, and she sort of did the role of being the interpreter. So uh, the story is all around that that uh, set of things, and it has a lot of uh, great acting involved. Uh, the teacher played a great role. Both parents played a great role. Ruby herself uh, was a great role uh, as well. So uh, overall, the movie is quite good. It's a drama. If you don't like dramas, it's not very uh, interesting. But overall, I think it really... And I'm not much of a drama movie sort of person. Um but um, when it's like a specific topic that I'm interested in seeing more and I'm not feeling, you know, uh, against it by any <laughs> reason in particular, um, I, I'm up for it. And I, I enjoyed Coda. I enjoyed it. It was a different kind of movie and uh, it got awards. It has a, a pretty good rating on EMDB, so pretty much recommend it. And uh, was one of the things that I was just looking for at apple tv and apple tv does seem to be uh, giving out some quality content uh so i'm quite happy with uh discovering apple tv stuff at the moment uh still enjoying one year free uh not sure if i would subscribe it if it was paying but for what it is i i'm i'm becoming more adept uh, of uh, streaming services for for media content um through my apple tv experience so yeah uh recommend the movie uh let me know if you've already seen it if you haven't seen it if you're interested in it put whatever comments you want on the comments below and that's it for this video if you enjoyed this video and would like me to keep doing this kind of content movie review content in specific please uh consider supporting me through patreon.com slash ps enough uh, other than that, hope you're having a great day. See you next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care.